Back in the 1930s, the biggest airship that you could actually fly on was the Hindenburg. It took four and a half years and cost a total of $42 million. It was made of 14 miles of aluminum, 85 miles of steel wire, and 350,000 square feet of painted linen fabric. To put this in perspective for you, it was more than two and a half football field lengths. Well, this enormous airship, the Hindenburg, took its first official flight from Germany on March 4th of 1936. Nowadays, an international airline can carry upwards of 500 people, but the Hindenburg could only take 100 people, including its flight members. It was a magnificent flight, with all the different sights that you could see, and the Hindenburg could travel at speeds up to 84 miles per hour. Now the crossing of the Atlantic could be done in half the time as it could be aboard a ship. At this time, it represented man's latest attempt at crossing the Atlantic the fastest, and it was successful in doing this up until just under a year of its first flight.